and welcome back to my channel. Today is a gifted day out. Our entrance tickets have been kindly gifted by Hobble Down. We are coming to see what safety measures they've put in place and hopefully have a lovely day. It is chucking it down. The weather is terrible. It's like the worst day to come. We've never been here before. It's like a children's farm park and that's definitely up our street. So we're very excited to be here and hopefully with the weather being a bit poor, it won't be very busy. a pretty cool play area it's like a big giant sand pit and whilst it's raining it's quite good where are you oh the lemur enclosure and we had to put on masks and at first we were a bit like why put masks with outside but it's because they can actually catch COVID too which is because they're a primate they're like the closest relative to us which is very interesting actually Cool. This place would be amazing if it was nice weather. It's amazing now, actually, to be honest, but super amazing if it was really, really hot again. I think weather's meant to be good tomorrow, which is a shame. Are you alright, fair weather man? I've just climbed inside the tunnel. This is so cool! And I've just said this is a really cool place and so we're discussing membership options which is quite exciting I'm going to spin the camera around and show you what we're going to head to next so there's a castle behind here and then look there's like a cage walk thing It's pitch black, that's really scary. <laughs>
ended up having a really lovely lunch. It was actually really, really yummy. There's basically loaded fries with various things on top. It's still raining. The rain has not stopped. It's kind of stopped for a few seconds and that's it. Um, but we're trying to carry on with the day and enjoy ourselves. The girls are wearing the wetsuit, so they're okay. All the enclosures have these like windows that you can see and it looks so much better than just a plain old cage or glass. It's so cool. Go across the corner. Who's this? Wow. Hi. Faster! Faster! I'll be really fast! Faster, faster! in the soft play now. It's really big in here actually. I thought it was smaller than it is. It's very quiet so it looks like everyone might have actually given up today. And we have to wear face masks if you're over 11. So there was just an announcement that came out that said about the face masks and that you have to wear them unless you're eating or if you're going around with your child in the soft play, which to me makes absolutely no sense at all because obviously if you're then coming past people in the soft play, you're all unmasked. So that doesn't make any sense to me at all. Um, but Hubby and I are both sitting here with our masks on, aren't we? Mm -hmm not really many other people but they're all kind of eating or drinking whereas we're not so we're just keeping ourselves safe it's a bit worrying that you don't have to wear them if you're following a child round we would if we were going in so there's a one-way system going on in the play area which is pretty cool hi good day out i'm having to film this end bit on my phone because i've just gone through all of the footage and my audio is rubbish so i apologize for that um hopefully the camera will dry out and it hasn't damaged my camera permanently but hobble down was a really really good place it wasn't busy at all but that was most likely because the weather was appalling the soft play again was open finally because that opened over the weekend there's quite a lot of things that are restricted there so they've got like black mesh things that stops you going in certain bits they've also got some one-way systems as well there's hand sanitizers like everywhere which i was really pleased to see 
and also that all of the staff were wearing masks too. Obviously there's hand washing facilities because it's a farm and there's quite, quite a lot of walkthroughs as well. So that was kind of naturally already there, but I think they've added a lot more sanitizers, which is very reassuring. We honestly had such a brilliant day despite the weather. Normally you have to book a time slot of four hours. You can only spend four hours in there. However, when it's not a very busy day, they do allow you to stay all day long. So when it, it's probably highly recommended to go on a bad weather day because it'll be less busy and you get longer there. But I really want to return when the weather's brilliant and sunny and dry, even if it's not warm, just dry. I'm really blown away by Hobble Down and I'm gonna leave all the links for the Hobble Down website down in the description box. Please go there to have a look for yourself and see what other things that I might have missed. There's also like a zip wire, um, aerial thing but you have to be 1.3 meters and Eva is the only one of my three children that wanted to go on it and she's not quite that high yet. So yeah thank you so much for watching this video. I think my next one is going to probably be the Isle of Wight. I have eight videos of those or it might even be Whipsnade Zoo. Come back and join us on more fun days out.